one, she just got struck by lightning, y'all. This is, look, she ain't been out here a full hour. I'm going back, I'm going back, I'm going back, I'm going, I'm going back, I'm going, I'm going back to who I was before. Do it. You scrolled on this video to do it. Right. They better hit that bell too. Oh my god! Okay, you need to calm down. They already did it. Let's get into the video. What's up you guys? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, your bitch, your home skillet biscuit, Dimplicity. And today we are here with a very new LP. Alright named runaway teen pregnancy all right so before we get into this lp i do want to say that the people that inspired me to do this lp were d sims and zarela because i kind of watch theirs like a lot and i also seen somebody else's i think v's lab or something like that and it just kind of made me want to do it at first i wasn't into it if you ask me and goddess they know like a while ago i was just like i don't know but once you guys uh voted and told me you wanted to see it i was really excited because i really wanted to do it anyways so this is our teen all right who is currently in her first trimester her name is anaj patterson and this is her sister mercedes patterson who she currently lives with so I'm just gonna go ahead and give you guys the little backstory real quick all right so uh you if you want to hear the backstory you can stick around and listen to it but if you want to just like go ahead and get into the gameplay I'll put the timestamp here so you can just fast forward okay okay so Basically, Anaj moved in with Mercedes about a month or so ago, and she's been staying here with her sister for, like, you know, like a few months. The reason why she had to move in with her sister is because their parents got burned up in their house, which burned down. So, Mercedes didn't, I guess, you know, like, she didn't really get along with her parents like that. So when she turned 18, she excitedly and happily moved away from home. And she hasn't spoken to her family in years, really. Like, she doesn't even really keep contact with her sister because, I mean, they're very separate in ages. So it's kind of like there's a not too big of an age gap, but it's just like, eh, it is what it is. You know what I mean? So... Mercedes is a prostitute and she earns her money the hard way like she struggles she works hard for everything that she has and she doesn't like kids at all she doesn't even like teens but you know she was just being nice and letting her sister stay here but once Mercedes finds out that Anaj is pregnant with her whom she thinks is her boyfriend there's going to be a you know a little argument and she's just gonna let her know hey you can't be here anymore and Anaj is gonna have to figure out what she's going to do so this is their apartment that they currently live in I'm gonna give you guys a quick little tour it is um, over here in Windenburg I put it over here in this area I really 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 love it all right so um, this is their little apartment right here. Okay, so when you come in, this is what you see. Everything you're running away from is in your head. Mercedes kind of always gave herself this little saying just to, you know, like, make her think, okay, look, I'm away from my family now. I don't have to be stressed about anything. Everything else is in my head. These are her paintings that she has on her wall. This is the little bathroom, very simple. This is Mercedes's bedroom. Very cute, very simple. Once again, well, not too simple, but simple enough. <laughs> and over here is where our star, Anaj, is going to, well, not is going to be sleeping. This is where she's already sleeping. So Anaj sleeps down here on the floor in this little sleeping bed because this apartment is very small. So you guys can clearly see why Mercedes does not want her to, you know, like keep staying with a baby. But this apartment is very small and 
Anaj is currently living out of a suitcase. So she only had like a few things. And these clothes right here are clothes that Mercedes, you know, bought her when she came to live with her like two months ago. Because like I said, their house burned down. Everything they had was gone. So these are all of the clothes that Mercedes bought her in these past few months. It's not much, but it was just something, you know, that she could have to wear. So she does have a few outfits, but nothing, you know, really major because she's really trying to rebuild her life after this fatal incident you know what i mean so here's something else on top of everything so let's go ahead and get into some game play all right let's go ahead and tell our sister because she doesn't know that we're pregnant yet but our friends i don't we haven't revealed to our friends that we're pregnant yet either so we're gonna see how she reacts but you know what before we tell our sister i think today we're going to Invite over our friends and let them know. Hey, you guys. Uh, I really want to talk to y'all about something that's going on. So, down here is her friend, Sasha. Sasha lives in the same apartment complex as... Who are they? I don't know what they got going on, but... Sasha lives in the same apartment complex as... Anaj and Mercedes and Sasha is Anaj's best friend but Sasha also has a son all right so she's a teen mom as well so Mercedes already thinks that Sasha is a bad influence you know she doesn't really like Anaj being around her one she doesn't like Mercedes already doesn't like teens then she doesn't like teens that are wrong so it's just like no it's a double negative but i'm going to go ahead and have uh mercedes not mercedes but a notch come over here and probably like just reveal her pregnancy to sasha so let's have sasha come on over here and i want to see how sasha reacts to this pregnancy i don't know y'all like i don't know if she's gonna judge her or what but let me have sasha uh just have a seat and Anaj, are you coming downstairs? Oh, it's raining today, y'all. This is a terrible day to get kicked out on. Uh-uh. Look, all right. So, going to go ahead and just be like, Hey, girl, guess what? I'm pregnant by Quan. Okay, she's going to be like, Why are you lying? You are lying. Friendly, uh, let's uh, ask her about her weekend. Let's talk for a little bit. And I want y'all to see how Anaj feels about this pregnancy as well. So, real quick. Skuma. All right, so, real quick, y'all. Anaj feels like she doesn't want this pregnancy. Okay, here's the thing. She doesn't want the pregnancy, but she does want the pregnancy. And I'm going to tell you how, all right? She doesn't want to get rid of the baby because she feels like, well, her parents are gone. Her sister doesn't want her. If she keeps this baby... You know, this could be the one thing that she has that could feel like family and love to her. But at the same time, it's like she's not ready for all of these major changes. You know what I mean? So, right here we have Anaj did not expect this pregnancy and is really not sure that she wants it at all. But it's happening. What should she do? She is currently in her first trimester and she'll be in her second trimester in 19 hours. So she's having a pregnancy freak out from discovering from discovering pregnancy. Pregnant. It hits a nod now. <clears throat> How young she still is. How little she wants anything major in life changing happening at this point in time. How little she feels ready to handle such a thing. And yet this pregnancy is exactly that. Major. Life changing. Impossible not to freak out. What will her parents say? Her friends, the father of the child. This one says, oh Lord Jesus, prenatal appointment needed from unscheduled prenatal appointment. And I should make and attend her prenatal appointment as prenatal care is an important part of a healthy pregnancy so this comes from the healthcare reduct mod that i got recently and i'm going to go ahead and schedule that appointment i guess because i do want everything to turn out well with our baby all right so great friends around other sims like to see them nearby not the best kids and the block is hot because they live on the block all right so let's go ahead and keep talking to friend i wonder how friend gonna react to 
All right, so she just she's like, girl, I don't even have a bed at my sister's house. Oh, zombie my clothes Wuba. are dirty. Like, <laughs> she doesn't have anything to wash our clothes. And I just feel like with everything coming in, I just don't know what to do. Like, I'm getting really fed up. But, uh, wait, did she just tell her about the pregnancy? Yeah, she told her about the unwanted pregnancy, you guys. So she was just like, Girl, so on top of all of that, now I'm freaking pregnant and I don't know what to do. Like, I'm not ready for all of this. And she's just like, well, girl, I got a baby too. So, like, and I'm a teen mom too. I've been through it. Like, I know how it is. It's not that hard. Well, <laughs> she ain't gonna say that, but. Do show. And now she's talking about her first kiss with him. And how she didn't expect things were going to end up like this in the future. All right, girl. All right, all right. Oh, look. There go her baby. Look. Have we ever met him? Let me see. Do we know him? Where is Eric? Focus the camera. I just seen your little head, boy. Let's be cute with Eric, and I think what we need to do next is, I don't know if I want to reveal it to my sister, reveal it to our other friend, or um, reveal it to Mama. her boyfriend. Well, not her boyfriend. It's not her boyfriend. It's oh, let me da. Her little uh -oh. boo that she been messing with for like a uh, month or so. Let me pew. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, all right, all right. So we finna go back upstairs. Oh, she just playing, not playing, but gained a sentiment with her best friend's son. Sentiment gained. I'm glad you don't think my llama jokes are getting up. Get out. Y'all say that about everybody. Look, ain't that many Sims telling them same corny as llama jokes. If it is, y'all need to get some new material. <laughs> all right. So uh, let me see. I'm gonna go downstairs with. Her sister, who is her sister talking to? Mercedes, who is this? All right, I'm gonna just go over here and I'm going to let my sister know, hey, I got something to tell you. I'm pregnant and I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to keep it. And she's gonna be like, uh, and keep it and go where? So uh, let's start complaining about our problems first before we uh, go to her. Girl, quit talking to him. Get out. Get out. Get out of this combo. <laughs> You're done. Oh, she got such a bad relationship with her sister. Alright, uh, let me see. Her sister really does not want her there anyways, y'all. Like, Mercedes wants to be on her own. She really does. Alright, let's see. I think I'm gonna go ahead and tell her. So, who we at? Pregnancy and family? Let's announce unwanted pregnancy. Or, I don't know what you gonna say. Oh, how's she feeling? Oh, oh, she said, oh no! She was like, oh hell no! She like, oh hell no! I know you're not pregnant! She's like, uh, 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 I can't do this. I can't do this. I'm sorry, sis. Like, I can't believe you got pregnant. It's already hard for me to afford paying all of these bills. You're not helping out with anything. She's just like, Mercedes, I never meant to make anything harder on you. I promise. Like, this isn't what I expected. I didn't plan this. <laughs> She's like, girl, bump all that. You gotta go. You gotta go. You gotta go. I'm sorry. Oh, wait, how's she feeling? She said, told about unwanted pregnancy. She hates teens. These sims get angry around teens because they think teens are loud as hell. Um, uncomfortably wet from being outside in the rain. Got into a fight. What fight? Who did she fight? The block is hot from being in the block. There's so many fine hustlers out here. Girl, oh. And cold-blooded. Cold-blooded sins deceive others when they're calm and focused. 
demeanor well with their calm and focused demeanor all right so we're just going to yell at her we're going to like argue we're gonna be like how could you be so stupid are you dumb you're only 17 your life isn't even are you are, what's wrong with you you just got here how could you be pregnant so let's be mean we're going to ooh. We're going to, ooh, we're going to accuse her of being a hoe. <gasps> yes, oh my God. Ooh, y'all, not them both crying. Mouse ooh, back, ooh, Mops okay. Vombo. Okay, now we getting into it. She's Kuba, like, you're Ruby, so stupid. Kuba. You just got here? And who are you even pregnant by? Swap you're such a hoe. Squirmish. <laughs> oh, for no. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh Lord, what else? Go in, go in, go in. And y'all, I even had it to where Mercedes Dina is going to talk about Anaja's child. So she's just like, you and that thing gotta go. I'm sorry. Ooh, 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 okay, okay. So school is stupid. I should be able to start working or living. Girl, we're not you trying to ask for advice. All right, so she's just like, Mercedes, listen, listen, listen. Mercedes, Mercedes, Mercedes. Okay, what do you think I should do though? Like, should I get rid of the baby or should I drop out of school? Like, school is already stupid. I should honestly just be able to start working or living life. Can I never go to school again? So, uh, Mercedes just like, girl, I don't care about none of that you. Not you trying to take a selfie right now and you're pregnant. Don't know where to go. Your sister just kicked you out. <laughs> She's just like, you know what it is, what it is. So let me see how Anaj is feeling. Um, all right, uh, still the same. Pretty much. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dropped your shit from Sam talking about your child. That's it. If I don't get to run this Sam the Fade, I'll lose my fucking mind. You don't talk about my child. That's a dying wish. So, ooh. <laughs> worry about your sussy hoe. From being called the so, but why is the Sam so worried about what I be doing on my fucking private part? Sitch by, probably because you're living in her house and notch. Like, I mean, you ain't got your own. Single parent from not having a partner. Oh, she's embarrassed. It was hard to tell another Sam about not having a serious romantic partner all the while being pregnant. And Anaj couldn't help feeling ashamed. Oh my goodness. So y'all, Anaj is feeling really stressed out. She's also feeling very ashamed. But I think what I'm going to have her do is go ahead and leave like Mercedes just kicked her out so we're just gonna go ahead and try to pack our things and take what we do have and just leave like oh they are not getting along down here with you and they can't fight because she's pregnant so damn this is horrible all right so let me see before we leave though I think we got to get a subway pass because we don't have one so we need to go purchase one real quick so we're going to use some of Anaja's money because we don't have any money. Like all of this money right here is Anaja's money. Oh, not Anaja's money, but Mercedes money. Anaja doesn't have any money. All right, y'all. Like she don't have no job. So yeah, she gotta. Oh, uh, she she just gotta do what she gotta do. But right now we're gonna go purchase a subway pass. Go. Oh. Yeah, Mercedes is over it. She is not feeling this at all. Mercedes is mad as hell. So you know what? I think I'm gonna have Mercedes come um curse out probably Sasha and be like, she's probably pregnant because she's been following behind your ass. Hold on, let me see. Let me see. Can I can I go up in here? I'm um give Mercedes some access. Let me have Mercedes go over here and cuss Sasha out like you're the reason my sister's pregnant and Sasha's gonna be like no your sister's pregnant because your sister made that decision I ain't got nothing to do with it so you need to get up at my house so let's be angry we're going to uh blame for problems yes we're going to go blame her for problems and then we're going to lash out angrily uh oh Mercedes just walking up in there too She's just like, bitch, I want to talk to you. Zardo. I got something to say. Oh, oh, oh. 
Sasha look like she ready for confrontation. Kumba, move me, Cleavar. Grush. Brankavint, Fina, Ifl, M. Gil. Left the towel. Busa. All right, so we gonna have Oh wait, 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 wait. All right, so we're going to get a. I'm gonna honestly get a 28 day pass because I don't know how long Anaj is going to be homeless, y'all. Like, she doesn't have anywhere else to go. She can't stay with Sasha because oh, yeah. then they're gonna probably uh -huh. push Sasha's rent up. And Sasha ain't supposed to have nobody else in there anyway. Who's this? Uh, please remove me from the call list. Trangella, Grenoi Bars, Boulay and Nagalna, Nebahana. New beam short. Zafis Moochie Peachy. Alright, y'all. So uh, Naj done purchased her subway pass. Uh, I think we're going to Oh Lord Jesus. Uh, not all of this wine began. Oh Lord. Alright, can we put this in our inventory? I hope so. I pray we can. Can we? Okay, so we got our sleeping bag in our inventory. Can we put this in there? No, no, we can't. We can't take our suitcase. Okay, look, look, look. It is what it is, alright. A notch is about to go ahead and get on the road, y'all. It is Wednesday. It is very sunny. All right. She hasn't even revealed to the boy that she's pregnant by yet that she is pregnant. All right. I don't know how he'll deal with this. So, you know what? Let's go ahead and just, before we move out, let's just, let's try to see what's up with him. Let's invite him over. Invite him out. I want to see what he going to do. And how are you gonna react? Cause I don't know yet. She's just like, hey, I need you to come over. We really need to talk. It's something important. All right, so Quan is on his way over. Let's see where he at. And let me put these walls back so y'all can see. Cause I know how y'all be. Oh, there he go. There he go. Look. Come on upstairs, boy. <laughs> All right, let's go see, let's go see. Uh, We're gonna go be romantic and give him a little hug. Uh, romance, let's, um, let, let me see. I'm going to discuss our future together. <laughs> and then I'm gonna discuss having a baby because I'm gonna see what he thinks about having a baby before I tell him that I'm even pregnant. So how does he feel about having a baby, all right? Do you want a child or no? All right, y'all. So she is currently discussing having a baby with him, and then she's going to uh, ask him if he loves her. So let me see what he says. Okay. Relationships are hard, but these Sims have discussed it. There's only two options now: go for it or break it off. What should we do? Babies are expensive. Are you sure that is a good idea? So he's thinking about the cost of the baby. And that's true. Babies are expensive. He's right, but shoot. Oh, but he said he does love her, all right? He said he does love her, which is great. So if he loves her, then that means that they can still probably, you know, they can probably, you know, work this out. That's good. Lord Jesus. I'm going to see how he react now, y'all. Like, I haven't told him yet. I'm about scared. I'm scared, low key, bit. We gon' we gon' see, all right. He said babies are expensive, but he loves me. All right, so let me see. All right, so we're going to announce this unwanted pregnancy. We're gonna let him know I'm pregnant, and then we're gonna tell him, and it's yours. How do you feel? Are you okay with it? Pregnancy and family. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, Tell Kwan he fathered and not just child. Okay. Let's see. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Okay. He did take that news pretty good, looked like. Let's see. Um, That's just about the pregnant part. So I think he he's putting two and two together. Like, uh, it's my baby. Oh! Oh! Child, y'all! He is so mad! He is so mad, y'all! Like, Oh my god! Is he crying? He's crying! Hold up! Oh my god! He just like pregnant. What the hell? Wait, my the baby's mine? How you know it's my baby? He's like, what do you mean? How I know you my boyfriend? He's like, I, I can't have no baby right now. Like, I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, I can't be doing all this. And then so she gonna be like, why? I thought you just said you love me. 
So, uh, let's see. Uh, mean. Let's. We're going to. We're going to insult him, and I'm going to say, I hate you. <laughs> She's <just> like. <laughs> You wasn't saying none of this when you were smashing me and your boxer briefs. Like, what are you talking about? So, oh, no, he did. He said, I hate you, too. I hate you. Well, you know what? I hate your ass, too. Do something. Oh. Do something. Oh. oh, my gosh. Okay, you know what? That's it. That's it. I think this is the last straw for a notch. All right, y'all? She's had it up to here. Her sister doesn't want her here. Her baby daddy doesn't want the baby, all right? And little does she know, her baby daddy has a whole B, okay? So, she don't know this yet, but she's going to find out eventually, all right? But he got a whole B, and that's why he really don't want this baby, because he don't want nobody to find out that he got a baby on the way, and that he done cheated on his girlfriend, all right? Because it's nobody's business. So... At this point, y'all. Oh, what he said to her? He going off what he saying. Make fun of style? Oh, Lord, no. No. All right, all right. We finna go, y'all. That's it. We leaving, we leaving, we leaving. Y'all, this is terrible. Her sister kicked her out in the rain. It's raining raining okay but you know what we gotta do what we gotta do and we gonna start something new for our baby it's okay we're gonna be moving out and we got it. we don't need no sister all right we don't need no baby daddy we don't need nobody it's just me and my baby okay so let's see um we're just gonna go are you sure you want to continue? Um, you're about to create a household with no funds. Your household will not be able to afford a new lot, but mm, let's give her like a thousand just so she can move on to a new lot. And we're gonna make her have zero dollars when she likes moving. So that's it, you guys. Anaj is running away to start her new life. in the middle y'all in the middle of nowhere all right so you guys this is going to be Anaja's new land her new lot that she has moved to all right so she has dreams and goals that I didn't mention to you guys at the beginning but she's always wanted to be a cook she's always wanted to open up her own restaurant and be an amazing chef but with everything that's been going on she just hasn't had time to you know really work on her craft and honestly I don't know when she'll be able to find the time to work on that craft with her being out here stranded in the middle of nowhere just on her own okay there are surrounding homes and things like that but we don't know any of these neighborhood but I'm hoping that maybe you know one day she can get to know these people and probably start a new life over here on this little island in Windenburg like she has gotten far 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 away from the main parts and she's probably just going to try to figure out her way to make some kind of money so we're gonna be living off the land a lot and I'm actually thinking about having her do some fishing do some gardening things like that to you know help her kind of hone that cooking skill because if she knows how to you know plant she could sell her produce in the future if she knows how to fish she could sell her fish in the future so we're going to be grinding living off of the land right now we have zero dollars and it is currently raining and she really needs to go to the bathroom <laughs> So, um, I don't know where we're going to go to go to the bathroom. We're probably going to have to go to, like, a bush or a gym or something. Uh, damn, where can we go? Where can we go? I know we can shower in the rain if we get dirty, but, damn. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Y'all, this is terrible. We really don't have anything over here. Is she crying? Oh, my God. Is she okay? Ugh. Oh, goodness. All right, let me see. Um, 
on. Yeah, she is going to do it. All right, so we're going to go ahead and just set her little sleeping bag up out here. I guess if you go, ooh, we need somewhere where it's like, kind of like under the trees. Yeah, let's set it up under the trees so it won't rain on us as bad. Like, it's going to rain on us still, but it won't rain on us as bad. And when we get some money in the future, we can get like a tent. But right now, we can't afford all that, okay? So, yeah, it is what it is. Let me see if she can use it. Let's see, uh, go relax it. Aww. And we also need to set up her a doctor's appointment, but I don't think we even have money to go to the doctor, y'all. Like, this is horrible. How are we gonna do this? How are we going to do this? Oh, Lord Jesus. All right, so look. It is currently 5.03 p.m. She is hungry. Uh, does she have any food in her inventory? No, she does not. All right. So, first and foremost, tonight we need to figure out how to go to the bathroom. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think this is the sex tree. Yes, we can go to the bathroom over here. So, we can go to, um, to the restroom in this little bush over here, the little woo-woo bush. And we can probably start finding things so we can try to, you know, get some money and sell this stuff. So, damn, y'all, we out here in the rain. Let me turn off. Oh, oh she just got struck by lightning. Oh, my God. No. No, she just got struck by lightning, y'all. This is, look, she ain't been out here a full hour. She hasn't been out here a full freaking hour, okay? I don't know what we're gonna do. We gotta go hide or something inside. Wait, look. Struck by lightning, Anaj was hit by a bolt of lightning. Ouch. Um, do we need to go hide? Anaj is positively crackling with electric energy. Lord, uh, not ready for this. Sometimes the torturous nature of being pregnant at a time when you don't want a child hits you like a train. Lord baby talk from discussing having a baby this topic is important for both of us regardless of what we decide children should come into the world love true very very true still furious from being furious with someone righteously indignant and shared dismay from announcing pregnancy Anaja's partner fully understood how distraught she is at the news of this pregnancy because they feel the exact same way it helps Anaja not feel alone in this experience okay so she understands that he doesn't want this child because she doesn't want the child at the same time you know but I guess it's because the fact that he was putting all of the blame on her kind of saying like what are you talking about like how are you pregnant? Whose baby is it? Like, she's some kind of hoe. Like, don't play her. <laughs> but, uh, let me see. Let's go dig this up and see what we can do. Girl, I'm gonna have you go pee. You might have to pee on yourself for the day. No, 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 no. You actually don't. Like, go fertilize this. I told you. Go over there. Go. That's your bathroom. Come on. We can do this, Anaj. We don't need no siblings. We don't need no baby daddy. We don't need no besties. Like, we can do this, all right? And look, it just stopped raining, so things are clearing up, all right? The seagulls sound amazing. Let's go ahead and head over here. Oh, this is such a beautiful scene. Anaj, go here. She's really hungry, too. Let me um enable advanced fishing like I was supposed to do. So when she does catch a fish, she'll be able to cook it. So let's see. Um... Uh, there we go. Girl, you look fucked up. You are super roasted. It's okay, though, sis. It's okay. Because you know what? By the end of this LP, if we get to the end of this LP, by the end of it, you are going to be successful. And you are going to have your very own restaurant. Okay? So that's all that matters. You will never have to starve again. And you know what? We gonna do this. We can do this. I have faith in us. Look, y'all. Y'all just saw the little heartbreak. All right, sis. Go dig this up and see what this is. I don't care what this is. Whatever it is, we're going to sell it, okay? Because we need any kind of money we can get. And honestly, 
We're in school, but oh wait, we're not in school. Okay, good. I'm gonna sell this homework too. We're not doing homework. We're not gonna be in school. We're not doing none of that. I don't have time for this stuff. I have to focus on what's important. All right, so we got a little treasure map. Where are we gonna even place it? We can't even look at it. Oh my goodness. All right, look. Let's go start fishing. Let's go get started. Oh, and we could probably cook the fish over here. Okay, this is perfect. So at least we won't like be freezing or nothing when it gets cold out. And I'm glad that it's still summer, so it's going to be warm outside for a while. All right, girl. Oh, girl. That lightning messed her up. <laughs> she, is, she is dazed. She is feeling it. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Let me fast forward through this because I hope we can catch something. We might have to bomb y'all and ask people for money. Oh my God. Okay, okay, wait. Did we catch something? Did we catch something? Y'all, she is obsessed with this phone, honey. I swear. She is so obsessed with this phone. All right, so she acquired the fitness skill. Looks like the fish in this area are too crafty for a nod to try fishing elsewhere. Damn. That was supposed... Y'all, and we got a dollar. Where did we get a dollar from? Can we buy something with this dollar? Y'all, we got to go somewhere. Like, we got to get some food or something. It's almost 9 o'clock, and we starving. We sleepy. We need the bed. So, let's see. Where can we... Where can we go? Where can we go? We're just stuck and helpless. Please. Wait, wait. Is that a dog? Is that a dog? Where's that? It's a dog. Oh my God. Yo. It's a day. It's some straight animals here. They're sleeping. How y'all sleeping? Y'all don't look sleep. Let's be friendly. Uh, uh, let's have a cautious introduction. We don't know these animals. Like this. All right, y'all, we got to get up out of this rain. We got to get up out of this rain. Right. We got to go somewhere for right now. So let's just go hide out and kill the Um, She does have a subway pass. Why can't she travel? Oh, no. I thought she had a subway pass. Oh, my goodness. All right, so we're going to have to uh, travel through these apps. So let me see. Uh, ah, she crapped it. Y'all, she's stuck. She can't even travel because she can't afford to get her internet on. We just gonna go to sleep until the rain over with. We gonna be starving tonight. This first night was rough. And she running around, running away from these dogs. Oh, she playing in the rain. Girl, look, uh-uh. I don't even know what you're doing all that for. Can we shower in the rain, though? That's what I need. We finna take a... We just going to be it. We going to be it right now. We just going to be it. Oh my goodness. Well, you guys, this is day one of Runaway Team Pregnancy. Let's hope day two brings in some money. All right. Can she sleep? Okay, at least she can sleep. Ooh! I'd be so scared for my baby, y'all. All right, you guys, this looks like it's going to be a sad, lonely, scary-ass night. So, I'm going to see you guys when morning comes. I hope the rain is gone in the morning. But, I'll see y'all when you get up. Okay, y'all, so it is currently 5.52 a.m. And she just woke up, all right? So... Damn, okay, okay, okay. I need to find some way to get her some money and some food. Like, we don't have any food, and I don't know what to do. So, let's see. Let's go like this. Because I think we might be able to, like, do something like roll the marshmallow. Oh, God. And there is her bladder, okay? Well, now she is extremely dirty. Extremely dirty. And... Uh, we still don't have an option to shower in the rain. This is horrible. Girl, I know, I know you hungry, sis. You don't think I'm trying to find you food? Let me see. Uh, Can I dig this again? No, I can't. Uh, let me go like this. Let's see if I can make some marshmallows. Damn, she stinks. Oh my goodness. All right, so the main thing that we need to take care of is her hygiene and her hunger. Oh, no. 
<laughs> Sister's like, damn, I'm tired of this rain. God, when you gonna stop it? <laughs> oh, look at her baby bump. Y'all look, it's so cute. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, her baby is going through the most. All right, so we gonna go ahead like that. Oh wait, but it's raining. It's probably gonna go right back out. No, please don't go out. Yo, but we can't even make no food. We have no option to make any food. All right, so you know what? Let's just, it'll go out. It is what it is. We can't go fishing because we're super <laughs> uncomfortable. <gasps> I don't know what to do, y'all. You know what? I think I know what I'm gonna do. We're gonna go over here and visit the neighbors and probably like ask them for some food. So let's, uh, can I visit them? Oh my God. I can't even visit our neighbors, you guys. It's gotta be something we can do. Wait, 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 is there something here? Please. We can't look for frogs because we're too uncomfortable. Oh, ooh, ooh. oh, we can't even rummage. No fresh trash? Damn, why is this so hard? Okay, wait, 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 what's this? We can't dig for, because we're still uncomfortable. All right, so we gotta find some kind of food or something. We gotta take care of ourselves before we can actually do other stuff. And it's hard to do it, y'all, because I can't travel. I don't have a subway pass. I can't get one because I don't have internet over here. <gasps> Anaj is burning to death? Wait a minute. Uh -uh. Anaj, get away from that. Get away from that. Extinguish it. Just extinguish it. Put it out. Put it out. We don't have time to die in episode one, all right? I don't know what happened to that subway pass that we purchased earlier, y'all. It's not fair that this is all happening to me. Like, why? Why is this happening to me? Oh, you know what we can do? Oh, I got a good idea. I got a good idea, all right. So we can, um, I'm gonna text my friend and ask her to send me some food. That's what I'm gonna do, all right. So let me see, um, let me open up Slice of Life. And I'm gonna be like, hey girl, can you send me some, um, can you door dash me some pancakes or something? Like, I'm really, really starving. All right, so let's send a message. Let's beg for pancakes. Yes, we're going to beg for pancakes. And we're not going to ask our sister for nothing because we don't need her. But Sasha, please, girl. I need something, I'm starving. And she's like, girl, of course, why didn't you say something? I wasn't thinking like I didn't know who else I could ask and I didn't want to seem like I couldn't survive on my own but I can't <laughs> alright is she gonna send me some pancakes please oh what she say oh hey Anaj girl are you gonna give me some pancakes respond give me some food please like you don't want me to die do you Girl, tell me some oh hey, bitch, where the food? What are you doing? You don't care about me. See, look, y'all, it really don't be nobody in your corner. Like, I hate to break it to you, but it really don't be nobody in your corner. Like, <laughs> cause what the hell? Why I ain't got no, oh my goodness. I'ma ask her for pancakes one more time. Send message, beg for pancakes. If they agree, it will pop up in your inventory. So Sasha didn't send me now. Let me send my other friend Will, Naomi. Please send me some, sis. Please. I'm starving. Y'all, none of my friends are helping me out right now. What the hell? You really can't depend on nobody. And she is hungry with a baby. Wait, wait, wait. Have you been eating all of your meal? Now, bitch, why would you ask me that if I just asked you to... Don't let me catch you on the streets, bestie. Because <laughs> what the hell? Like, um... Oh, my goodness. I don't know what to do, y'all. I really don't know what to do. All right, y'all. So, I don't think she's going to be able to eat today. But I think what I am going to have her do is go ahead and join a career. So, we're going to try to get her a job um, doing something so she can earn some kind of money. Like, maybe fast food or something like that. Um, what else can we do? Uh, 
delivery services. Ooh. Fast food employee. There we go. So she's going to be like a fast food employee. And we're going to have her do that. She'll make like $11 an hour. Okay. That's a good little start out job. So it should be something that she can do you know, to make money. But I don't know how she's. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Who's that? Who's that? Is that a person? Is that a person? Oh, ooh, ooh. Who is this? Who is this? Jay, look. Hey, ma'am, ma'am. Could you please help me out, okay? I am starving. Uh, let's have a friendly introduction. I'm going to ask her for some money. Go, 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 go. We got a bomb, y'all. We really got a bomb. Like, I'm going to go ask this lady for some money. I hope she give me something. If she gives me enough, maybe I can uh, order something to eat to be delivered here. Because we still can't travel until we can, like, get a subway pass and it didn't let me get one last time so i don't know maybe i need to update that but let me see what she's gonna say all right. all right hi nice to meet you um i normally don't do this i really don't ma'am i don't want you to think that i'm a bum or anything but can i please have some money like i promise if i ever make it in the future i will pay you back please anything y'all she gave me $429, all right. So that's a little bit of something, all right. I don't know what we can do with that. I'm hoping that we can probably get a computer real quick or something. Um. Oh no, and we got the bugs coming out too. Look, Lord Jesus. Y'all, we, we just, we going through it. We going through it, all right. So let me see, Um, can I go to her house? Cause if I can go to her house then, Maybe she'll have internet. And then if she got internet, I could probably use her computer. So, yes. She probably like, um, yeah, baby, here you go. Um, here's some money. But you said you want to go to my house? Um, I don't know about that. <laughs> um, let's, uh, we're going to complain about this rain. And we're also going to complain about what else? We're going to complain about our problems. And then we're going to complain about our parents. Like, <laughs> I just miss them so much, you know? Like, I can't believe this is what I'm going through. So, matter of fact, let's just complain about everything. Fuck it. All right, so I think she lives, like, over here. Where's the house? Oh, over here. Can we go? Uh-huh. Oh, who is this? Who is this? Who is this? Y'all, this is another person we get some money from. Okay, so let's go meet her and let's go ask her for some money. Friendly introduction. Friendly introduction. The more money we get, the better, all right? Because then we could actually buy another subway pass and probably be able to travel. So let's see. Um, How much is a subway pass? Clever, How much is a subway pass? Hold on. Y'all, I don't even know. It's not even letting me know how much one is. An acquaintance was telling me how much they dislike you. Try being a little nicer. Becoming disliked is a slippery slope. Oh, so a Mercedes is the only one that don't like me. So that means she was talking ish about me to my friends. Okay, okay, big. Big Mercedes. All right, I see how you want to play. All right, now let me see if this girl is can. Well, will give me some money. Let me see. Uh. Friendly, friendly. No, no, no. Come back. Please come back. Please. Can I have some money? Anything helps. I promise you, ma'am. 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 Anything helps. I don't care if it's a dollar. Honestly. Please. Okay, y'all. We almost at 800. That's it. All right. So, look. Now that we got enough money, let's see if we can. One, I'm going to go ahead and get our internet set up over here. I know we're, like, in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> But if I don't have internet on this lot, then nothing will work. So I need to go ahead and get that set up so my phone can freaking work properly. All right. So let me go ahead and get that set up. Show Bill's information. Um, home services. No, no, no. We're only getting internet. That's all we need right now. And internet is $75. So that's fine okay so we can't afford internet and i'm going to go ahead and purchase a subway pass so once i buy a subway pass you guys i will come right back okay okay <laughs> all right 
you guys so we are back and um i thought this was just so funny i don't know why but this girl is like taking a picture of her not what i, I don't know why this on screen but she's taking a picture of her and anaj is just looking like bitch don't be taking pictures of me i know you just gave me some money but still though so i didn't really get um much set up at anaj's spot nothing too different so what we're gonna do now is finally have her go ahead and travel so we're going to click travel through the little apps menu. We're going to go to maps and we're going to travel. So we can finally go somewhere to like shower and stuff, get ourselves taken care of, get our bladder up and get some food, all right? We got about $400, so we're going to make sure that we spend it wisely. We don't want our food to be too expensive. We can't be all bougie and stuff as normally. So I don't know where we can actually go to like get a shower. Um, Maybe we can go to the pool. So hopefully at the pool they have some showers because we smell terrible and I'm not trying to have a notch look grungy and dirty for the whole episode that's just that's not it for me okay <laughs> all right all right y'all so we just got to this little windenburg water park i wonder if swimming counts as bathing yourself is it a shower over here i don't see not one freaking shower y'all where are we gonna go to get clean how are we gonna get clean Oh, hell no. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. It's stuff. It's downstairs. It's downstairs. Okay, great, great, great. Is it a shower down here? Is, is that a shower? Okay. 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 It is a shower. Okay, perfect. All right, so we're going to go ahead and go to this restroom, and then we're going to shower over here. So, this is going to be where we take all of our showers. We're not going to take any quick showers either because child we have been sleeping outside we are dirty as hell so we are going to take a steamy shower i can't wait to take this long shower and then hopefully go get some food all right i know anaj is starving oh shoot why i was taking you to the bathroom why would you pee on yourself why i was already taking you to the bathroom oh my goodness and we just got a no excuse reward. Have a sales bladder fail on a lot with five or more toilets. I agree. There is no excuse she should have peed on herself. <laughs> like, girl, that is so shitty. Why would you do that? Go on with your little stanky self. And you better not, you know, you know what? Let me find out. She gonna mother freaking die when we get to a restaurant. Because at this point, that's what you're doing. You wait till you get something and then you die like will not die but then you just turn up no 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 you are not clean i want you to take a thoughtful shower well a steamy shower take a long shower you are not finished you are really dirty girl she thought she was getting out of there that quick uh -uh, you smell like this you are not getting out of that shower yet all right and that baby needs to be taken care of so clean yourself and you gotta go eat because i know that baby is suffering all right so now we have to shower Let's see. what's going on hunger failure what did she eat what did she just grab okay so her hunger did fail and she just grabbed something to eat it was some emergency food i don't know what but um she got about $400, so I'm going to try to see if I could go get her some food from somewhere. Child, we got to buy some food and stock up. So, let's see. Uh, Let me go back through the apps menu so we could travel. So, we're going to go to maps, and we're going to click travel. You know what, y'all? Instead of actually, like, buying some food, I think what I should do is, like, buy like a little freezer and just like have little quick meals and stuff like that so she can eat so she'll never really get like fulfilled but she will be able to have quick meals and stuff like that and i don't know when her first shift is for her job but i don't know how this gonna work with her being pregnant and everything so who's gonna be able to like take care of the baby well the baby will go like daycare i guess but 
technically we not gonna be able to afford daycare so i'm probably just gonna have her quit until like we can get enough money to have her afford air quote daycare you know what i mean because i feel like realistically she can't leave the baby at daycare if she can't pay for daycare so we're not gonna do that all right you guys so we are back on our little home lot and it is still raining y'all it's like day two of raining non-stop why did she have to get kicked out when it was like a freaking tsunami going on like this makes no freaking sense so um let me just have her go over here and sit on this bag go ahead sis. and i think what we're going to do is just go ahead and buy her a little cooler so she can have something to eat out of i hope it's not too expensive but i feel like it's the only way we're going to be able to like save money and constantly get food to eat you know what I mean? Like, it's small, it's there, it's convenient, and it's helpful. So, that's what we're going to do. And she has the little thing down by the by the ocean. Is that the ocean or is it the sea? I don't know. But she got a little thing down there by where she fished for fire. So, we're probably not going to get her one of them right now. Because I don't think she really needs one. Because she has one in such close proximity. So, yeah. All right, you guys, so we spent about 200 of her dollars, all right, and we did get her a little thing right here so she could, like, get food out of it. She could probably put food in it. I don't know if we can, no, actually, I don't think we can put food in it, but we can put this in our inventory, which is good, so we can, like, walk around with it. Like, if we get hungry, it's going to be right in our pocket, okay? And we also got her a bike so she could have her own mode of transportation, all right? So the bike was also, I think, 100 simoleons as well so this is her little setup this is all hers all right don't play with her put some respect on her name right now we're going to go ahead and matter of fact food is expensive our hunger looks pretty good so i think what we're going to do is just go ahead and just go back down here and try to fish so we can sell that fish and make some money now that we have other ways of eating and can we use this yes let's dig for treasure because maybe down here we can find some kind of treasure girl go find that treasure what's this don't worry about it don't worry about it just go do what i ask go Oh, y'all, and her bump is getting bigger. All right, all right. So, let me see if we can actually set up a doctor's appointment as well. Because, uh, oh, she's already in her second trimester. This pregnancy is not getting any better. There is still time to make a difficult decision. But the nod is just not sure. Not matter, wait. No matter what she does, the damage is done. And there will be no going back from this. Life is permanently altered. All right, so we never set up a appointment for her. So let's see if we can try to do that. I don't know now, but I am going to attempt. So once we finish digging for this little treasure, we're going to go ahead and set up our appointment. I hope we can find something good. And I hope we have enough of money for our appointment. Okay. Did she get something? What's this? Oh, we got two things. Okay, so we're going to... Oh, wait. We could donate blood. Can we get money for it? Nah. Nah. Okay, okay, okay. So we're going to schedule a doctor's appointment for a notch. And we ended up going. Oh, what's wrong with her? Why is she blue? Why was she blue? What's she this? Fine. Skunky scent? Wait, what? Wait, Anaj's appointment has been scheduled. Appointment holds only last for three days, else Anaj loses the slot. If she no longer needs an appointment, it will be canceled. Attend the appointment by using the phone under the healthcare services menu. Okay, cool. So let's see. Uh, let's go to healthcare services. And we're going to have her go ahead and go to the doctor's appointment. So let's go ahead and do that. It's currently 1 p.m. She's going to go soak them wet. But let's go ahead and sell this. Can we sell this? What 
sell them when we get back, I guess. Wait, um, go to doctor's appointment. Should I not do sick leave to attend this doctor's appointment? Um, oh yeah, I forgot she was, um, let's say yes. I forgot she had a job, so we gotta, um, cancel. We're just gonna go ahead and quit this job. I'll put it when she comes to bed. Cause, like I said, oh, wait, wait, wait. It's time for her appointment. We're going to go ahead and go now. Yes, I can say that. Oh, y'all, that's it's only forty dollars, but still, forty dollars is a lot when you don't have money. So that's gonna put us in the hole. Oh, would it not like to know the gender of her baby? Yes, 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 yes. What is the gender? What is the gender? Hold up, hold up. I have to go now. Try not to miss me too much. See, go, but what? I didn't invite y'all here. Okay, after a moment of feeling a nod, this Pat, wait, a nod, Patterson belly. It is the daughter's expert opinion and joyful job to announce that she is going to have a baby boy. Oh my goodness, a nod, you finna have a baby boy, which you don't really want to have a baby boy, but. You know, at the same time, she does want to. It's just, she's really scared right now, y'all. But I don't know how things are going to go, you guys. I hope everything is going to go well for her. Right now, we just found out that she is going to be having a little baby boy. All right, so, y'all, drop some blue hearts in the chat for a nudge, all right? And with that being said, you guys, we're going to go ahead and end episode one here i hope you guys enjoyed it i know it was very chaotic kind of all over the place because we were trying to figure out how to make money and what to do what but now that we can freely travel i think things are going to work out a lot better for her and once she starts being able to catch fish and cook them up i think her dreams of opening up her restaurant will come into play but we can't do none of that until we figure out how to deal with a brand new baby on our own as a runaway mother freaking team okay so with that being said y'all go ahead and make sure y'all give this video a huge thumbs up i love you guys so much and i will see y'all in the next mother freaking live stream or video whichever comes first bye y'all So before you even be like, uh, I didn't like that video, guess what? I got way more videos on my channel that you could check out right now. Okay? Period.